Hi everyone, it's Richard at Outfins. I'm going to do a couple of technical analyses, quick ones on APE as well as Trust Wallet, TWT. And I'm going to do that if you go to the technical analysis section. Here you will find about 55 technical analyses uh, of uh, about 55 top coins where we um, do our own in-house research and analysis, looking at certain patterns, breakouts. You know, in most cases right now, we're looking at a lot of emerging patterns, but here and there, there are some breakouts. Um, and we can take a look at those as well. And, and this is a really a time-saving tool for you, especially the beginners, but even more advanced traders to find some trading ideas Again, this is um, not investment advice, but uh, this is a good place to start for, for, uh, for your own analysis. Uh, but the two that I wanted to show you are APE, which is trading in a channel down, as indicated in the pattern type column here, channel down. It's emerging, so there hasn't been a breakout yet. And if you look at the, uh, the chart itself, as you can see the price has been basically bouncing back and forth between these channel resistance and support trend lines. Um, so it is clearly in a downtrend, making lower highs and lower lows. And the way that a trader would trade this is basically buy at the, um, the support trend line and sell at the support, uh, um, the, the resistance um, resistance trend line or even short at this level so right here um, as you can see the price has reached the resistance uh, trend trend line uh, it also coincides with the four dollar resistance zone here so um, this will be a good time to potentially I would at least potentially short it here uh, with the anticipation that the trend downtrend in the channel down pattern will continue and the price will will then just go back to three dollars or lower now um, you know I would put a, a stop loss around you know four dollars and 25 cents or so um, so you know if I'm wrong and the price actually does break out and then I would reverse my trade and go long and basically buy it that would be a channel a bullish channel down break uh, breakout or you can uh, set up a uh, um, an alert, a price alert, and just wait for that bullish breakout and see if it happens. And so we would put uh, the price alert at about 425 and see if the price breaks through that level, in which case it's a bullish breakout. But right now, it, in the more likely than not, the price will continue to trade between these two uh, trend lines in the channel down pattern. Um, so that this is sort of a, a bearish or a negative outlook uh, in the near term. Um, now the bullish one is, is and you can see here, whether it's neutral or bullish or bearish. The bullish one is Maker, but I also wanted to look at Trust Wallet Token. This has been, uh, this this one has been on the tear um, ever since the uh, FTX meltdown. As more users decide to take uh, take ownership and responsibility of their own. Um, wallets or on their own uh, uh, custody of, of uh, assets um, then trust wallet is one of the choices along with MetaMask and many others trust wallet is owned by Binance they bought it I want to say maybe even two years ago and it's just right now post the FTX collapse <clears throat> really exploded in terms of usage and attention from users and uh, and so as you can see here the price really broke out basically more than doubled in a matter of a few days then it's consolidated here in what uh, looks like a bullish pennant and you can find more information in our knowledge base on this topic but a bullish pennant <clears throat> typically forms after a very sharp advance then the 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 the, the traders uh, start taking some some of the profits while others um, try to get in at the lower prices around that support zone of dollar uh, eighty, and so um, and so once the the selling um, subsides and and uh, 
uh, you know, the selling pressure um, is absorbed by the buyers, then it typically breaks out bullishly out of this pennant, which appears to be doing that just now. Um, and so the price should, based on the theory, um, advance back to that um, high of 275 or maybe even higher than that. Um, so this is a bullish breakout here. And then a bullish, what I think is bullish, although it doesn't appear that um, obviously perhaps, but it's, it's Maker. And Maker is a, is a well-known, well-established uh, DeFi, decentralized finance uh, protocol or project, um, generates revenues, been around for you know several years. Now, overall, it is in a downtrend. Um, as you can see, it's kind of uh, traded between the support zone of 600 to 700 as a support and then the resistance zone around the thousand dollars. It's kind of bounced between those two um, support and the resistance zones. And so um, now we're back at that support and this support has held back in June. It's held up in September and it appears to be holding up again right now you know throughout november and and end of october so my bet would be that um that this support zone does hold up and that we bounce up from this uh, at a minimum you know near term or the nearest minor resistance is the 200 day moving average right here which is around 900 dollars. but we could actually revisit that thousand or eleven hundred dollar resistance zone again um, so that that would be my my trade um, for for maker. All right, guys. Again, this is a, a fantastic way for you to get quickly um, some trading ideas. At the end of the day, it's sti still your decision, but it's also a great learning tool, I think, but with very simple uh, way of of analyzing uh, potential trades. Just looking at the support resistance levels, potentially some patterns, some breakouts, you know, looking at the momentum in terms of MACD RSI, you know, using just a few basic concepts of uh, technical analysis, not going any, you know, not doing anything particularly crazy, but I think simple is better. And that's, that's my mantra. And I think that particularly for beginners, that's the way to uh, get started. So if, uh, if you have any questions or feedback, please email us at invest at Good luck trading.